will go back again we were in the process of discussing the concepts of optics which are required for grade 12 students in fact the major phenomena that we are dealing in the chapter we just mentioned and i gave you some some examples of the phenomena exhibited by light we didn't uh, get into it in detail of course it is a big chapter so what i want to tell you is today before we wind up today's class i'll give you one question for you related to what we have done the second thing i remind you that if you have anything to be discussed about this optics please do mail us or get back to us and say this is something which we are going to discuss uh, next class next week again we will be back with some more contents and more, more questions basically we will focus on the grade 12 uh, board paper questions so what i want to tell you is you observe the phenomena which are seen around you based on reflection refraction dispersion total and reflection diffraction interference and polarization for polarization i was having a very beautiful video which i will show you in the next class only today the time doesn't permit for that so uh, i will just give you one question for you before uh, we wind up today's program see one question the question is this one the whole young's double slit experimental setup which is used for interference experiment when we uh, produce uh, alternate dark and bright bands we see that the bandwidth which is there that is beta is 2 millimeters. So, 2 millimeters is the bandwidth produced in a Young's double slit experiment simply. If the whole Young's double slit experiment is now immersed in water, it is under water okay, and water has refractive index 4 by 3, the whole setup is placed inside the inside water. In that case, what would be the new bandwidth? The bandwidth now is 2 millimeters and if it is the whole thing is if immersed in water then what will be the refra uh, sorry what will be the bandwidth. So once again I am actually uh, I am giving this uh, question also to you you can work it out. So once again let me tell you the question the fringe width or the bandwidth obtained in Young's double slit experimental setup is 2 millimeters when it is placed in air. Now with the whole setup is kept immersed in water and water refractiveness of water is uh, shown here 4 by 3 then what will be the new fringe width new bandwidth work it out i had asked you one more question before you can think on that as well when seven colors are passing through a prism why only violet has got maximum deviation uh, red has got very minimum de deviation how will you explain exactly what is the proper way of framing the answer if you know the answer these two things one is this question second is the one which I mentioned now these two questions if you can uh, tell us what the answer is you can get back to us and again today almost the time is going to be uh, up for uh, our time allotted to us for this program is going to be over but before I finish off today's session let me tell you something make use of the classes in such a way that you can benefit it for the board examination and you can uh, what to say relaxedly you can see at home watch the program at home and uh, get back to us this program is made for you it's for your benefit and especially those who are unable to go for any extra classes you make use of this and uh, uh, get back to us with your doubts okay with this note and next week i will just uh, show you one uh, interesting video related to polarization plus we will be focusing on the board examination type of questions. These two are the areas which we will be discussing next and if anything straight concepts to be discussed like derivations or something if you want me to discuss in the class you can definitely let us know. Okay, With this and again with uh, one more uh, once again uh, with congratulations to the people from the service to subcontinent uh, from our sub subcontinent Pakistan and India one is Malala Yousafzai and uh, the uh, Nikesh uh, Satyarthi, Ka sorry Kailesh Satyarthi, these two people, I will let, let us congratulate them on winning the Nobel Prize. Okay, stay tuned with NTV and we will see again in the uh, next week with the topic optics for grade 12, stay tuned.